Hello everyone, Phoenix Feather here, and welcome back to the Farming Sim 17 Phoenix moment, where we talk about everything that happened last week, everything going to happen, everything's going to happen this week, bleh, and so on. So, first things first, huge shout out. Let me go down the list to Mr. Chief Romney, who donated a total of four dollars. He donated two dollars twice. Um, Mr. John Sutton for a hundred, huge hundred uh, fifty dollar donation. Mr. Keller D24 with a huge $100 donation. Uh, Brad for a total of $11. He donated $5 once and then the second time $6. Mr. 12 Valve 69 with a total of nine, <laughs> $9. Uh, he donated five once and four once. And then John again with another huge $20, $26 donation. For a total of $300. That's right. We hit our $300 donation goal for Team Rubicon for the hurricane relief. Uh, they are currently helping out in Texas. I'm pretty sure once Irma works its way through Florida and Georgia and all that, they'll be be down there too. So yeah, $300 uh, is just awesome uh, that we, the flock, can, can uh, contribute to such an amazing some you know amazing organization so uh, thank you guys so so very much for making that happen it's awesome we're going to be doing some more of these in the future uh, i've already talked about it with um chief romney and and more mods those are two who uh, worked on the the chevy 1500 uh, i do have a couple of models they have a couple of ideas as well so, d look for it in the, in the future. Maybe a higher donation goal and have more rewards released each one. I'm thinking, maybe. Mm. So, yeah. I, I'm, I'm so happy right now. Uh, when, I, when we got over that, we were, we were stuck for so long. We'd be in $26 short. And uh, John, being the awesome guy he is, uh, stepped up to the plate and just finally donated the, the last $26 uh, just to get us... Just to get it to our goal, which is, I, I can't thank him enough. Again, he donated a total of $176. That's, that's huge. Huge. That's almost, that's almost two-thirds of it right there. So, thank you so very, very much, guys. Much appreciate it. And, again, huge shout-out to mod, more mods. I kept, keep trying to call them mods more. Anyway, more mods and Chief Romney for, for hooking us up with the Chevy 1500 to release. Uh, to you guys, it, it it's an awesome truck. Uh, I don't know where where they've released it publicly yet. Um, if I find a link, I'll ask them, and I'll post it in the description down below. And definitely will be in Wednesday's mod spotlight. So there's that. <laughs> um, yeah, awesome stuff. Just super awesome stuff. Thank you guys so much for making that happen. Um, yeah. Okay. Whew. Now, how do I top that news? I don't know. Again, last week um, was a little bit iffy when it came to my videos. I'm still uh, trying to adjust because not only am I I'm recording and rendering and uploading on a different or a different time than what I was before the school started, I am also uh, having to do like day-to-day -day life in between. <laughs> so. My, my recordings and upload it's it's a bit spotty as I still try to figure out um, where you know when to upload what where <laughs> so I apologize it should it should be more under control this week because I've already got uh, everything up until Wednesday already rendered um, just gotta fire off the uploads which I'll do probably um, I'm gonna re-render this video and then start posting on, or start uploading so yeah um so this week should everything should go as planned i know so far i have this going up on monday at 12 uh wrong wrong uh attachment there all right there we go i got this going up monday at 12 la Noir at 5 p.m um tuesday will be the Outcast County, me being the police, and Tuesday or at 5 p.m. it will be 
Car Mechanic Sim 2018. Uh, all over on my oh wait, we'll just go through this main channel first. Uh, let's hop in here so we can get stuff done. All right. So Tuesday will be yep. Yeah, okay, Wednesday will be uh, at 5 p.m. Will be L.A. Noir again. Thursday will be the Outcast County me being the bad guy and. Followed by that will be probably either the Hunter or Room of Six Siege. I think it's the Hunter. Yeah, it's probably going to be the Hunter. I think that's already rendered and ready to go. Um, Friday will be Let's Play and Finding Bigfoot. As far as live streams go, um, Tuesday will be Tuesday Night Farm or Moves Day Farming as I've, I've, I've called it. <laughs> uh, Tuesday seems to be a perfect day to do that, so uh, we'll be we'll be streaming on Tuesday uh, at eight after eight p.m. at night, Eastern Time. Uh, Wednesday, of course, will be at twelve o'clock noon Eastern Time. Uh, will be the live mod spotlight that got a better turnout than I thought it would. We we hit forties. So that, that's a lot better than I thought it would do. So uh, we're going to do another week of that. Um, and then Friday, of course, will be Farming Friday. Saturday, we're hoping... Can I not drive here? Hold, holy crap. Friday, we're hoping... Or, excuse me. Saturday, we are hoping uh, to have something a little bit different. Uh, we were supposed... Well... We thought about doing it this Saturday, but uh, it it didn't go through because we didn't have access to the computer. So um, we used the old server. We're working. We're currently working a new server. Monty's been extremely busy, um, but we've gotten ELS working in another server. We've gotten the oh god, I cannot drive and talk at the same time. Uh, we've gotten the. F1 trainer working. We got a ton of cop cars in. We've got the uh, rotator lights working and all that good stuff. So we're really excited for it. It doesn't have all the other features of the old one, like eating and all that, but that's not really. That was. Uh, it seemed to be like a hassle, more of a hassle than what we have currently set up on this new server. So we're hoping. To have that ready and going by Saturday, uh, and we can live stream on it. We're gonna try recording on it actually tonight. Uh, the skins we I need to I need to reskin all the vehicles. Uh, so for the first few weeks of the stuff that you see, it will be different skins than what we're actually gonna use, which I'll explain in a video later. But anywho, uh, that there's that and. Um, yeah. By the time you probably see those videos, actually, it, the skins will already probably be changed. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, what else? Um, yeah, I think that's that's about it for the main channel. As for the secondary channel, uh, we're, we're gonna have Minecraft up on Monday and Roblox up on Wednesday. That's that's the simple that I missed last week's. But I did upload Minecraft on Wednesday and Roblox on Friday, so I still got the stuff up, which I'm super proud of uh, getting it up at least. So, yeah. I think it's, that's about it as far as schedule-wise. not 100% certain. I think it is, to be honest with you. So, yeah. That's, that's really what we got planned for next week. And like I said, this will be the week that, like, I've already got over half my work done already for the week and it's currently Sunday at 6 o'clock p.m. so got a, a lot done already and we'll be focused on getting more done throughout the week like I'm I got stuff to do Monday I got stuff to do Tuesday uh, I think stuff to do well Wednesday I'll be I have to live stream so I won't have anything to do but yeah, it's gonna be a busy week so yeah hopefully I can get more stuff done this way so I get everything scheduled when I want it to and so on but uh, 
I'm glad to see you guys are liking the Finding Bigfoot stuff. Like, we average like 50 some viewers doing the Finding Bigfoot stuff. Uh, I was shocked. You know, after I after GTA went down, uh, I thought for certain that a lot of you would just book because you know Finding Bigfoot's not really a class A title. Like, it's not huge, but a lot of people really seem to enjoy it, and we got a lot of new faces in. So. Um, a lot of people were asking us to do Finding Bigfoot Live, and we finally, we finally did it. So I'm, I'm actually kind of happy with the turnout, and we might have to look into doing some more of that in the future. I, I don't know. I do not know, but it's it's there. Um, we had to end it early because Saturday nights is is an early night for me, and I can't stream too much past midnight anymore. So. <laughs> We had to call it early. We did get him down to half health, and uh, you'll guys see it in the future. That's not our best. Uh, we've actually done better than that. <laughs> you'll see in a couple weeks. <laughs> so yeah, that's there's that. Um, YouTube still still is hitting me hard with with this whole new algorithm bullcrap. Um, they. They're practically flagging anything with guns or anything in it. So it's it's really taking a, a huge toll. And the sucky part about it is extremely, extremely sucky part is after like the first few days that they claim it's not advertiser friendly, uh, the, the review actually goes through and it says it's advertiser friendly. So when I'm making the most money off my videos I'm not making money so pretty much they're they're they are a, just eviscerating any money I make off of those videos they say it's not advertiser friendly which what when it's not advertiser friendly they put limited or no ads on your video and then when you can request a review and when I request the review there's only been one so far that I actually did not it, they kept it as limited or no ads every single other one out of the I want to say at least 20 reviews that I've put in you know 19 out of those 20 have been flagged or you know proven to be advertiser friendly so it's a real shame and they're doing it to everybody uh, they did come out and say that that they uh, this is not how they wanted their algorithm to work but instead of fixing it they're just gonna let it teach itself uh, I, I saw that in a video it could be worse uh, destiny 2 youtubers um, I was watching a YouTuber and said almost 99% of Destiny 2 videos are being struck down uh, as not advertiser friendly. And it's just like, wow. wow. Rainbow Six is the same way. Rainbow Six, every single video I post that's Rainbow Six Siege uh, gets flagged. And then uh, I every single time they reverse it. So, I don't know. They they need to take a stance and be like look we screwed up we'll fix the algorithm instead of just saying we don't want it just demonetizing gameplay videos that's not the reason why we created it you know <laughs> we don't want it doing this but we're going to keep it letting it teach itself what to flag and what not to flag it's like really why don't you turn that off and fix the problem instead of saying hey it'll teach itself and then you know months down the road like well it's not learning let's we better fix something you know that's that's what it looks like it's going to now so um as i did i re there we go as i i've been saying in a, a bunch of previous videos if you guys can afford to throw your favorite um, YouTuber, content creator, what have you, a few dollars, feel free. I'm not talking about me. I'm talking about any content creator that you, you 
you really enjoy your favorite YouTubers, um, you know, if they have merch, buy some merch. They get they get a certain percentage of their merch sales. You know, if you you can donate, donate um, to them. If you if they have a subscribe button on their Twitch, or if they have like something like uh, Game Whiffs, where you subscribe each month and you get certain benefits go through that they have a patreon subscribe to their patreon um, there's a lot of people who did this for either part-time or full-time that are seeing their their income just destroyed I mean it's it's getting bad so again if you have a favorite content creator and you really enjoy what they do um, especially if they're smaller, the bigger guys have a ton of people supporting them. Uh, they have, you know, it's not even a concern for them because they have Patreons where people pay them hundreds of dollars a month just to be a Patreon subscriber. Uh, so, you know, they, they're, they're okay. I'm talking about your smaller YouTubers. Um, if, if you have a YouTuber that has like under, under 100,000 subscribers uh, getting less than a thousand views per or less than a couple thousand views even per video you know again do what you can to help them out because I they appreciate it now more than ever so that's going to do it I'm sorry for my little rant there but uh, that's going to do it for today's video guys if you did like the video be sure to leave a like down below if you guys want to see future Phoenix moments be sure to click subscribe and as always guys Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.